Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. How does the Bill of Rights protect individual civil liberties? The Bill of Rights, the first 10 amendments to the U.S. Constitution, plays a crucial role in safeguarding individual civil liberties against government infringement. Here's a detailed look at how it achieves this. Liberty protections. The first four amendments focus on personal liberty. The First Amendment protects freedom of religion, speech, press, the right to peaceably assemble, and the right to petition the government for a redress of grievances. The Second Amendment ensures the right of the people to keep and bear arms, emphasizing the importance of a well-regulated militia. The Third Amendment prohibits the quartering of soldiers in private homes without the homeowner's consent, a provision rooted in historical grievances against British soldiers. The Fourth Amendment safeguards citizens against unreasonable searches and seizures, requiring specific warrants based on probable cause. Justice System Protections Amendments 5 through 8 set forth guidelines for the justice system. The Fifth Amendment requires an indictment by a grand jury for major crimes, protects against double jeopardy, and ensures that individuals are not forced to incriminate themselves. It also mandates due process of law and just compensation for private property taken for public use. The Sixth Amendment guarantees the right to a speedy and public trial by an impartial jury, the right to be informed of the charges, to confront witnesses, and to have the assistance of counsel. The Seventh Amendment preserves the right to a jury trial in civil cases, preventing courts from overturning jury findings of fact. The Eighth Amendment prohibits excessive bail, excessive fines, and cruel and unusual punishments. Additional protections. The Ninth Amendment states that the enumeration of certain rights in the Constitution does not deny or disparage other rights retained by the people, such as the right to travel, vote, marry, and make decisions about one's own body. The Tenth Amendment reserves any powers not delegated to the federal government, to the states, or the people. Extension of protections. Initially, the Bill of Rights limited only the federal government's power, but subsequent Supreme Court cases extended most of these protections to the states through the 14th Amendment's Due Process Clause. Civil Rights and Liberties. While civil liberties protect individuals against government actions, civil rights ensure equal treatment under the law and freedom from discrimination. The Bill of Rights and subsequent amendments have expanded to protect both civil liberties and civil rights, particularly through the 13th, 14th, and 15th Amendments. Due Process of Law The principle of due process of law, enshrined in the 5th and 14th Amendments, ensures that the government must follow duly enacted laws and treat citizens fairly, following established procedures. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning into our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.